What's up guys, we are back with another video review. This time, we're going over this Gundam. He comes with this. Little spaceship. Has a hinge joint here. You can go like that. And this. Actually, specifically, this part right here. Looks into that slot there. Now, I don't know if this is part of a, or one of those, Gunpla kits. Pretty sure it's not. I might be mistaken, you know, and quite frankly, I don't know which Gundam this is. Let me know in the comments if you do know. Other than that, let's move on. Now, the articulation on this figure is very good. These arms can move out. About that much forward and the same back, which means, yes, they can go 360 degrees around. The head is on a ball joint, so you can turn, you can look up that far, down that far. Uh, not very much, but yeah. The arms, all these are along... A whole bunch of ball joints, one here, and right here is a hinge joint. So, it can go like this. The arms can bend about that much. Not very much, but, yeah. Now, the funny part about the arms is that I actually put them together so I found this in a 25 cent box which for what I've seen of prices on Gundams Gunpla and correct me if I'm saying it wrong on you know Gunpla but for what I've seen on the pricing of those that's actually you know 25 cents is actually a very good deal Now, like I said, I had to put the arms together. They might not be correct. You know, let me know down below in the comments. You know, now the legs can move up about that much, and this, yeah, I guess you would call it a skirt. This skirt here kind of restricts it from moving up any further than that. They can bend about that much, and they can go back. Again, the skirt is preventing it from moving any further, but they can still move pretty decently. There is a ball joint on this part I forgot to mention, which means that this can move around for some other decent poses. Now, the feet, they can go up that far, down that far, and they are on ball joints, which means they have a pivot, and they can go, they can go all around. Now, all this articulation can get you some pretty decent poses, such as this one. this one, and this one, which is supposed to be a karate kick, but eh, could use some work. Now, from what I've seen of Gundams and their art style, the sculpt of this figure captures it pretty well, actually. Uh, it has that Japanese t type of armor, and the color, the colors are vibrant, not to mention they look good on this figure. Again, I don't know which figure this is of the Gundam series. Um, if you do know, please let me know down in the comments section. And, you know, I'm, 
for those of you stopping by to check out news on the Etsy page, I'm still working on it. Uh, you all have a good day, good night, whenever it is that you're going to be watching this. And God bless.